6.20. I have been awake for about half an hour and gotten a shower. My husband has already left at 6 to take his sister to the airport. And Nova is still sleeping. I'm going to give her just a few more minutes. I've been rushing around. I got a shower. Um, I put on a little laundry because we definitely need that done. And I'm going to try to deflate the air mattress before I go get her so that she's not like, what is that? <laughs> and then I got to wake her up because we're going to have breakfast at 7 a.m. with the rest of his family that is going back to South Carolina so we can say goodbye. I don't want them to go. <laughs> Pro tip, buy yourself an air mattress that has a pump and built in to deflate itself. Delightful! They've come so far in air mattress technology since when I was a kid. Good morning! We're going to the airport. We're not going to the airport. Daddy went to the airport with Aunt Charity. We are going to breakfast with all, everybody. And we're going to the airport. We're not going to the airport, baby. Daddy had to go to the airport. He's coming back though. He'll meet us at breakfast. We're actually a little late. <laughs> we might, I don't know if we're gonna make it by seven because I went outside and the tile guy is already there. And I was like, oh no, do you need the tile right now? Cause it's locked up. Like, we don't just want it sitting out. And he said, no, he's gonna prep all the walls, which is fine. So we don't have to get anything out. But I was talking to him and <laughs> now we're late. I can't believe he was there at before 7 a.m. He's like, don't worry, I'll be quiet. I'm like, we're all awake. It's six at the latest. I don't, it's fine. I don't want to get all my, hey, I did it. You did it. Good yeah, job, I baby. Be, I don't want to go around, I want to go around, I want to go around. Yeah, that would hurt me. Yes, if you wind that cord around your wrist really tight, it will hurt. Last night, I woke up customarily, I said to pee, because <laughs> I'm pregnant, but, at 2.30, there was something going on at the house across our street. There was a, f a fire truck, an ambulance, a police car, and something else. And they were there for quite a while. So, in the light, like, with all, they weren't making any noise, really, but all their flashing it lights were on. I don't know, baby. Draw your pictures. And I don't know. I hope they're okay because there's, like, a like 50s 50s couple that lives there and then one of their parents who has a walker so I'm hoping nothing happened to her oh what do you say if I'm talking and you need to tell me something oh excuse me yes a pencil very cool so I don't know I was up for like an hour <laughs> Those, I put something over my eyes, but there were really intense flashing lights for quite a while. I hope I hope she's okay. Not in the hospital or worse. Woof. <laughs> it's like 10 o'clock now. It's actually four minutes still. I have a counseling appointment. So I'm waiting in the parking lot. I just pulled up. It got crazy there for a little bit. We had breakfast. Nova did really great at saying goodbye to everyone, but she's very not good at goodbyes. Um, it's a little overwhelming for her, but she hugged everyone and didn't cry, so that's good. Although I can definitely tell she's sad and kind of grouchy and tired today. And then we went grocery shopping because we don't have any food in the house, and there were lots of good buy one get one free deals at Publix, so we went a little over budget, but like ground beef was like three ninety nine a pound, which where we are, that was two dollars a pound cheaper than it has been the last several months so we got some of that to freeze etc etc um and then we rushed home i put away all the groceries and the tile guy wanted to talk to josiah so i gave him as long as i could and then i was like okay here's the baby i gotta go <laughs> i don't think the ambulance and fire truck was good last night josiah was sleeping in the living room of course because we can't be in our room right now and he said that the paramedics rushed in because he was sleeping on the couch. So he saw that they rushed in, but they did not really have any urgency at all when they came out. So 
I'm thinking something happened to the older lady, which makes me really sad. But, oh well, I guess that's life. So yeah, I'm gonna have my counseling appointment, go home. We're gonna somehow survive today. <laughs> All very tired. And yeah. Did we have a good nap? Yeah. And I had crackers. A butter cookie? Yeah. Are you going to go to the title store? Um, not today. Yes, we are. Now. Right now, we got to get different size metal trim. We got the wrong thing. What do you think about that? Hi. Sleeping on mama? Yeah. Are you sad? Yeah. Yeah? What are you sad about? Uh, me and papa was a bunny and Chris. Yeah, everybody went back to South Carolina. <sighs> you miss them? Yeah. Mama misses them too. But good news, we found out that the grandma across the street, nothing happened to her. Just the guy's wife had an asthma attack really bad. And she had to go to the hospital, but they were able, she passed out apparently. Um, so the paramedics were able to revive her and then they still took her to the hospital, but that's why they weren't very urgent on the way out because they were able to help her. You done sleeping? Yeah, why are you wet? You can lay on me. No, I'll lay on your lap. No, no, don't kiss me. No. Don't kiss you. Hi. Got some, my feet some You got marker on your legs? And marker on my feet. And on your feet. <laughs> you got tattoos? Yes. Like Maui does. Like Maui? Not like Mama and Dada, my deal. Just like Maui. <laughs> You're silly. For your favorite, yes, and Mimi and, and Mimi Papa. and Papa. Bethany and Elijah and Bethany and Elijah and who else? Who else? And who else? Uncle Chris. <laughs> I'll eat this. Don't eat it. Um, um. Hey y'all, it's 
about 7.15. I'm sitting on the bed in the office. Everyone in my house is asleep. My husband went to bed on the couch, so I'm in here. The baby went to bed about 6.45. Because she's really tired. And I'm just getting some sock knitting done. Because... I can't, I want, do I want to go to bed at 7.15? Yes, but it is, it's daylight. It's daylight outside. There's no way I can go to bed. In our old room I could have, because we had like really good blackout curtains. And it wasn't at the front of the house. But I don't think I could go to sleep right now. So I'm gonna knit for a little bit. I'm in about four inches on this sock foot and I need to be at about five and three quarters before I start the toe. So I got myself some snacks. These are, I don't know if they have them anywhere but the US, but they're like popcorn chips. And these are the kettle corn flavor. I think their other flavors are mediocre. But these ones, I could literally eat a palette of them. They're so yummy. And I never buy them because they're ridiculously expensive, but they were buy one get one free today. So tonight we party with pop chips <laughs> and sock knitting. I guess I'll try to be in bed by eight, even though it will still be daylight outside. But I know tomorrow everyone's gonna be up late, exploding fireworks. So I should try to get some sleep now, yes? <laughs>